Vibes Cartel freed. That is it. The appellants are freed. Beanie Man forced to relocate restaurant. This is not a business beer. The man they want to kill me on the road. And Anthony B opens up about health scare. They say I have a puncher tube, a puncher tripe, something leaking inside of me. So I had to go to the emergency room and have an emergency surgery done immediately. and subscribers welcome it's levels with kishima your space for all things entertainment get ready for your latest and hottest e-news reviews interviews and so much more thank you all for subscribing and if it's your first time checking in remember to hit the subscribe button and click the notification bell Vibes Cartel has been freed. After serving 13 years in prison for the murder of Clive Lizard Williams, Cartel Sean Storm and their two co-accused can walk free. In case you missed it, here is Justice Marvia MacDonald Bishop. As we have said, we have looked at all the other factors, but we find by now, having weighed everything in the balance, that the countervailing the weight is against a new trial. Our judgment will explain everything in depth, but as we say, this is for the decision for you to understand what the court has done. Having regard to all the considerations the court has taken into account, we conclude that the interests of justice do not require a new trial to be ordered for the appellants. And we therefore make the following order. Judgments and verdicts of acquittal are entered in relation to the appellants. We must, on the record, thank our judicial clerks, Mr. Jordan Jarrett, Mrs. Yumika Harris McKenzie, and Mrs. Nicole McLennan, and Ms. Chanel Hunter. Had it not been for them, their assistants would not have been able to make the deadline given the workload of the court and the various things that we had to do over the past couple of weeks. So we give them the weight of the credit and we thank them wholeheartedly for their assistance. It leaves us to thank counsel on both sides for your spirited, maybe sometimes combative arguments but we have learned tremendously from both both sides and we hope that the judgment will show that we appreciated the scholarship and appreciated the issues for resolution so that is it the appellants I sat Buchanan, one of the lawyers who represented Vibes Cartel, in an interview with CVM TV, said this. Although there is fixing for the justice system, the Constitution work has always been our belief. And I want to thank the team, Mr. Clark, Mr. Labish, Mr. Chevaria, and myself for the hard work that we put into it. It was a long fight, many years, many things came from it, but. We are now um, here awaiting the release of Adija Palmer. What time will cartel be free? Um, that's how, that, 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 has, that has to happen. Today? Has today? Start, the process has started and, and we would hope today because the constitution said something about no, that. No, the judge said that he's free. The judge says he's so free. So the question now. Yes. Yeah. This is their independence, emancipation, <laughs> July 31st for them. Yes. And so it, 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 it should be that. And so um, I am sure um, you've heard the posture of the court that the, the wheel is in motion. And if I were you, I'd be heading over to uh, another another venue to, to see to see that. My, my, my thought, you know, and I, I, I've done many interviews. I've done many interviews, and we've always said this. So I'm going to sound like a broken record God in God on time um, God do, we we only do the, the we do the work while God we are grounded in the faith and that that's what it is God on time and time so you are confident of this outcome I'm confident we were confident hit up the comments and share your thoughts 
Hii ni man is advising fans and supporters that his new restaurant Sima on Mona Road will be relocated to Shocking Vibes. In a recent live, Beanie Man said this. Yeah, show me. Yeah, show you. This is not a business beer. The man who want to kill me on the road. Stop now. Nobody knows I'm not having this symptom. Oh, God, Jesus Christ. No. Oh, God. All right, it's 12 o'clock in the night. We find a new location for um, Sima Restaurant. Sima Restaurant will be a Chicken Vibe production at the studio, my studio, half consent period. You know where Shocking Vibe is. We're going to move the restaurant to deal. Yeah. Mona Road, we're getting too much fight. We're getting fight from everybody. We're getting fight from everywhere, everything. Is it? So, yeah. It makes sense. You put it somewhere where everybody loves it and everything. So, people, all my fans and well-wishers, and everybody who love the food and everything, we are going to move the restaurant from Mona Road to Shack and Vibe production. Please, just understand. And trust me, don't worry about it. Don't worry about what cost it, nah, nothing. Can nothing to cost it. There's no war. There's no violence. There's nothing. We just need a bigger space. And we need somewhere to open so people can come there and relax themselves. We have no parking there. We have nowhere to park the cars and, and, and anything. So we have no, right, no. Everybody know that. We are going to be a shocking vibe. Blessings. Love you all. This is Being a Man. And I'm out. Rasta. Beloved. Listening to Beanie Man, I have so many questions. Is he trying to cover up the real reason? Was he being intimidated or forced to relocate his Sima restaurant? What do you think? Hit up the comments and share your opinion. Anthony B is revealing for the first time the health scare that caused him to pull out of Reggae Sum Fest at the last minute. On Instagram, he shared this. Ja Rastafari, I'm here giving thanks for life, giving thanks to be alive. July 17th of this year, I flew to Jamaica to do Reggae Sun Fest in Montego Bay. While I'm there doing my rehearsal with my band at Down Sound Record, I feel this pain in my belly. Terrible, terrible. Then went to the hospital. They say I have a puncture tube, a puncture tripe, something leaking inside of me. So I had to go to the emergency room and have an emergency surgery done immediately. The doctor said if I don't go and get the surgery done, I won't be here tomorrow. So I'm here now. I was discharged from the hospital yesterday. So I'm here to give thanks for life. No one knew the minute, no one knew the second. We're here because of the grace and the mercy of the Great One, the Creator of all things, the Father of all things, the Giver of life. So in everything I do, I will be forever giving thanks to the Most High to be here. And I want to take this time out to also give thanks and big up all the medical staff at the University of the West Indies Hospital in Mona. Yes, I got to take time to big them up. It was nine, ten hours of surgery. I went in after 12, which is like the 18th of July, and I never wake up until the 20th of July. I realize the amount of things that I went through. When I wake up, there is so much hose coming out of my body. 
different places. Who is true man knows who is true here, who is true here. So I'm here and I'm alive giving thanks. I want to take time again to big up all the doctor because I tell them thanks a thousand times. You understand? So big up all the doctor and I never take life for granted. Take nothing for granted. We could be here now and this and gone the next minute. So in everything you do, give thanks for life. Yes, I'm back up running. So I'm, I'll be journeying today, back on the road, reggae and the river in California, Humboldt County, California. I will see you on the 2nd of August. This will be my return performance. Give thanks, I'm healthy and strong. Initially, some people felt that Anthony B's press release about withdrawing from Reggae Some Fest was vague. But this goes to show, never jump to conclusions until you know the facts. Get well soon, Anthony B. <laughs> At it, that you know. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And turn on the notification bell to never miss a second or frame of levels. With me, Kishima. Got any burning questions or suggestions for future content? Drop them in the comments below. We love hearing from you. Until next time, stay entertained and keep leveling up. Mm -hmm.